Hey guys, what is going on? Welcome back to the channel. So today's video we have another Hot Wheel Mega Car build and this one is going to be absolutely awesome. We actually have the what's it, the Cadillac C or ATS VR which is like the race car version of the Cadillac ATS-V. And I think this is pretty awesome. And it even comes with the actual Hot Wheel of it right there. You can see like the building block car plus the Hot Wheel car. Uh, I do want to mention before I get started with opening this, I do have a merch store. So, so down in the description down below, there's actually a link to my merch store. I have a whole bunch of car related products as well as a bunch of Hot Wheels. Got a bunch of new modern Hot Wheel main lines from Case Unboxings and a bunch of other crazy cars like premiums, RLC cars, even some other collectible cars cars on there so definitely go check it out link description down below so today's video we have the mega hot wheel cadillac ats vr and i think this is really awesome and on the back it does show a couple others so i did a previous video with some of these other kind of building block cars i have a giant bone shaker right here i also have this smaller one which is i think really cool and then here's the Hot Wheel version of that. It's the exact same car. I think that looks awesome. So this one, I believe, is like the same scale as this. And if you guys are interested in picking one of these up, there is a link description down below. You guys can hop on to Amazon, pick one of these up. And I believe they actually have these on Amazon as well. So if they do, I'm going to include the link. But also, there is an Audi that's coming out soon that you guys can see right there. So if that is available as well, I will add that link in addition to the others. So let's go ahead and move the bow shaker out of the way. We can go ahead and bust this open, pull out the card, check that out, and then when we get started with the build, I'm not actually going to film the entire build process, but I'm gonna go ahead and get it started, and then I'll catch up with you guys kind of throughout the build, but first I wanna check out the actual Hot Wheel car version of this first, and be able to see what that looks like. All right, so went ahead and got that out right here, which I think that looks absolutely amazing. The attention to detail on the front end, all those vents in the hood, has that giant wing there on the back, which looks really, really cool. And all the designs down the side. I think that is a really cool car. Put down in the comments down below what you guys think of this Hot Wheel. And I'm pretty sure they've made a few different variants of this. They actually had a Hot Wheel NFT garage uh, it was actually the NFTH car of the same one. So I think that's really, really awesome. That is that is such a cool car to be able to do something like this out of. So we got that sitting right here, and then we're going to go ahead. And like I said, I'm going to go ahead and just get started with the build process itself, and then I'll catch back up with you guys a little bit later, kind of throughout, uh, before I even finish. Sometimes I want to show like the interior before I get all closed up. So definitely stay tuned for that. All right, so before I got too far into the build, I did want to show you guys a bunch of cool little features already. I know I haven't really gotten much done on it so far, but right here on the side, it does say Cadillac, which I think is cool. But yes, that is a NOS bottle. So I did want to show that off before I close everything up because there's like a little gauge. You can kind of see it hiding right there, a little white gauge on the NOS bottle itself. And that's this really cool kind of gauge cluster, not gauge cluster, like the center console. I got a gear shifter, a little e-brake right there. So before I got all this kind of too far, I did want to show you guys that little NOS bottle because I thought that was actually really cool. Nice little touch that you'll probably never see or notice, even like that little gauge on there. So yeah, I just wanted to show you guys that. But let me go ahead and get back to building this and I'll catch back up with you guys a little bit later in the build. All right, so I did want to show you guys some more little updates. So the interior, I'm pretty sure is done. We actually have a seat right here. And then obviously the other stuff I showed you, finally got the steering wheel in place and everything's kind of coming together. And yeah, sure enough, that's going to all get closed up pretty soon. But also I wanted to point out these really awesome, they're not really, well, I guess you can call them decals. They're actually like printed on the bricks. So I think that looks really cool. You don't have to worry about any kind of like stickers falling apart or getting a misaligned. Those are like actual decals printed on there. And I think it looks absolutely amazing. So I'm going to go ahead, finish this car up, and then I'll catch back up with you guys when the whole build is over. I'm um, actually like working my way along pretty quick, so I'm just going to go ahead and catch back up with you guys at the very end. All right, guys, so there we have it. We are completely done with the car, and I think this looks absolutely incredible. Like, look how amazing that looks. They actually did a really good job, especially with like the front grille, like the headlights and everything, all the decals down the side. Those look absolutely amazing. And there's just so much more to it that I love. The giant wing as well, which I think is really cool. But something I did really like and I was kind of worried about is when you look at the car from above, you see those giant rear fenders and then the front fenders like that as well. Just 
massive wide body fenders and they actually did a really good job with that you see how wide the rear fenders are as well as the front fenders and then even all the little detail there on the hood they actually were able to kind of replicate that as well which i think that looks really really good man and even like the giant wing looks really cool as well and i think overall mega did a great job with replicating this hot wheel car I think that is awesome. Like all the attention to detail is there. The designs down the side, on the fenders, like everything just looks absolutely amazing. But like I said, if you guys are interested in picking up one of these, uh, if, if it is available on Amazon, I'm going to have a link in the description down below. I'm also going to have some of the other ones as well because I have like the Roger Dodger, the Bone Shaker. I even have like an Aston Martin and a Pontiac Firebird. So definitely go check it out. Link in the description down below if you guys can pick up some mega Hot Wheels because I think these are pretty cool. But also don't forget, I do have the link for my merch store down in the description and you guys can get entered into some free giveaways with some awesome Hot Wheels or maybe even some Legos coming up. So definitely stay tuned. But if you guys like the video, hit the like button. Subscribe if you haven't already. But as always, thank you for watching.